Hello, everyone. Hello, Hi. teacher. How are you this evening? Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you doing, teacher? I'm doing all right. Just great. Oh, wait. How's your vacation? Did you do anything interesting? In quarantine. But all very good. In quarantine. Did anybody go out? No? If you did, you wouldn't uh, admit it. <laughs> I think you would not admit it. <laughs> well, at least I hope you were able to rest, right? I want to see everyone. I don't see you, Ligia, Rodriguez, Jose Torres, Mariela. Let's turn your cameras on. It's okay. Great. Okay. Welcome to another class. I'm happy to see you again. And we're going to pick up where we left off last class. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Let's see that. So everybody access the platform, please. And we're going to see how to request, how to give advice, actually. That is tonight's topic. Let's see, just thinking of suggestions. So we're going to start right here. Guys, did we see a pronunciation of these words? I can't remember. Let's review it anyway. Transmission. Robotic. Creation. Syllable stress. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice which syllable has the main stress. Satellite. Internet. Photograph. Invention. Assignment. Computer. CD-ROM. Engineer. Entertain. Where is the stress in these words? Can you pronounce them? Okay, first of all, repeat after me. And we're going to identify where the stress is. In this case, the stress is on the first syllable. It, second words is on the second syllable and in the last one, all right? So for instance, we're gonna say, Satellite, like this. Satellite. Sa satellite, like that. Satellite. 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 Okay, internet. S satellite. Internet. 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 Photograph. 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 Yes. Okay, invention. 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 Yes, invention. Invention. Assignment. 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 Computer. 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 Okay. CD-ROM. CD-ROM. Engineer. 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 Entertain. 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 Or you can say entertain. 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 Yes. So, Entertain. Mm -hmm. so you have to pay attention everywhere you hear, pay attention to where the pronunci where the intonation is, okay? Because that's very important. Just like it is in Spanish, right? We don't say el teléfono, right? We say teléfono. So that's very important. And in English, we have the same pattern, okay? Let's see, how would you pronounce this word? The first word, Alain. Language. It's plural, though. Language. Languages. Languages. Yes, languages. Very good. Okay, how would you pronounce this word, Arturo? Telephone. Very good. Okay, next one, Mariela. Transmission. A transmission. Mission. Mission. Transmission. Yes. Next word, uh, Carlos Calderon. Robotics. 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 Yes. Robotics. Next word, uh, Javier Carales. Uh, 
I don't hear you. Sorry? I understand. Ten at the end. Understand. Some people say understand. It's not like that. Understand. Okay. Next, Roberto Santos. PCR. Very good. Okay. So that's it with pronunciation. Let's move on. Read the objective. Let me see. Who? Lidia Ramirez. Remember your mute. In this session, you will practice a conversation about using a, a cell phone, see imperatives and infinitives for giving suggestions in context. In context. In context. Right, that's intonation right there too. Thank you. All right, pay attention to the infinitive form. Okay, if you notice, uh, what's the infinitive, guys? Or imperative. Any idea what that is? No? We use the hmm? be sure to. Yes, that's imperative. Well, guys, look. The imperative is basically the base form of the verb. Uh, tell me some verbs. Play, go, wash. What else? Walk. Walk. Yeah, walk. Okay. So, Eat. look, guys, this right here is the imperative. Okay, it has no conjugation. So I can say, hey, play outside. Play outside. That would be imperative. Okay, I'm giving instructions or a command. If I say go, um, go to go school, uh -huh, go away, or I don't know, that would be imperative. Right. Right? Same for that. Wash. Your teeth. Wash yes. your hands. To prevent. To prevent COVID. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, this is imperative. Right, and you see it's very easy. You simply use the verb, that's it. Walk <coughs> every day. I don't know. To be healthy. So the imperative form is uh, instructions, right? Commands, orders, or also advice. It could be recommendations. Okay. It's very easy because you ha you only have to use the verb. That's it. For given suggestion. Yeah, it's also to give suggestions. That's right. Is it clear? Clear. Pretty easy, yes. huh? Yes. All right. Now we're gonna see a conversation of these people using this. Hold on. Let me see. I will show you the conversation from here because. You can't see it clearly in the platform, so let me go there. All right, pay attention, guys. Phone to call my boss. I can't believe you. Hi again. Listen to the audio program. Please pay attention because at the end of the conversation, I will ask you some questions. Get ready. Listen and practice. Can I borrow your phone to call my boss? I can't believe you still don't have a cell phone. Here you go. Thanks. Now, what do I need to do? First of all, be sure to turn it on. And don't forget to dial the area code. Okay, I can see the number, but I can't hear anything. That's because you haven't pressed the call button. Oh, good. It's ringing. Try not to get too excited. You'll probably get his voicemail. Hi, this is Joe Jones. You're right. It's a recording. Sorry, right Make sure to hit the end button, or else you'll leave our conversation on his voicemail. Ready? Who owns the phone? Who are they calling? What's the first thing to do? We will answer those questions later. So, 
Uh, first of all, new vocabulary here. Any new words? No, are you sure? Okay. Turning on. Sorry. Turning on. Turn it on. Let me see. Da, da, da. Ah, turn it on. Okay, what was the meaning of turn on, guys? What's the opposite? Like uh, turn on. Uh -huh, like yes. Turn on. Turn on. What's the opposite of turn off? Turn on. Basically, give you the answer. Turn off. Turn off, right? So, for instance, I can say, "Hey, turn on the light," and turn off the light. Okay. Uh, in this case, turn on the phone. So means meaning it was not working, right? And then you turn it on, now it's working. What else? What's the meaning of dial? Reset. Similar to push the, no, the number. Yes, we go to 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 put a number in the cell phone. Yes, the what a great definition. <laughs> yes, exactly. Now, help me with something. Pay attention, everyone. And where can you see the imperative form? Let's find it. Imperative, guys. Where can we see it in the dialogue? Remember, in practice, it's the verb with no subject and no conjugation. Here you go. Mm, no, but thanks. No, the thing is, it has it, imperative. You don't use any subject, just the verb. Don't forget. Make, make sure to hit make the end sure, button. Yes, don't forget. Thank you. Let me see. Try not to get too excited. Look at this, guys. B. If you notice, no subject, right? No conjugation, just the verb, plain and simple, and then a complement. So be sure to la la la. Don't forget, this is the negative form. Don't, and then the verb with the base form. Forget. What else? Try. Uh, try. This is another imperative. Try not to get too excited. Make sure. Make sure. Yes, make is a verb and then the complement, right? Make sure to do this and that. So all of these are imperatives. Because you basically start the sentence with a with verb, with no conjugation. Okay. Let's practice the dialogue. So what I want you to do is practice it. First, you're gonna be Jenny, Richard, then you switch, and finally modify the dialogue. Talk about, for example, a laptop instead of a phone. So first practice, then modify for another uh, device, okay? Is that clear? Yes. yes. Alrighty. It's cool. Let's practice in person. Let me see. Here, accept the invitation. I sent this image to WhatsApp, so we're ready to practice. Here we go. Okay, I'm doing. Okay. okay. Um, Can I borrow your phone to call my Oh, sorry, sorry, sir. Uh, Can I bor borrow your phone to call my boss? 
I can't believe you still don't have don't have a cell phone. Is the lesson that we are studying right now? Yes, for example, if I tell you uh, switch the TV off, is Yo creo que sí. Ahí mandan, donde mandan la información siempre. Mm, qué raro. Porque el, el enlace para la, para la clase me la enviaron al, al número normal. Uh -huh. No la pusieron en grupo. Uh -huh. Usted sí está en el grupo, ¿no cree que tal vez busca mi número ahí y me la envía? Eh, ¿Cuál es tu número? Podrá. El número es 6028. 5767. Si no me aparece. Sí, que a lo mejor no. Yo creo que no estás en el grupo. Su, ¿Su número cómo es? El mío es. Hello. Hello, teacher. Eh, I, sent, eh, a... I sent the image right now. Yeah. Y, okay. My classmate, uh, he is not in the WhatsApp group. Yeah, that's what I'm hearing. Emil, what happened with your camera <laughs> in the end? I never yeah, seen No, the camera doesn't work, teacher, but uh, I expect that the next month in September, uh, mm -hmm. maybe I change the, the laptop. So, oh, you're completely going to change that. Yeah, yeah. but uh, currently my, my camera doesn't work very well. Okay, I understand. Yeah, thank you. Let me see. I'm trying to send this. Uh, so, hold on, hold on. Medardo. Hello. First class. Hello. Is this your first class? Can you hear me? Yes, in my case, yes, I can hear you, teacher. Maybe Medardo uh, is confused in the group. I don't know, maybe he's in another level, but I don't know. <laughs> Let me see, hold on. Medardo. Este es el enlace que me enviaron. Para la clase, no sé, tal vez me he equivocado. No, no, pero esta es su primer clase. No, no, ya ha estado anterior. Y conmigo, no, ¿verdad? Que... Mm, no, con otros, teacher. Sí, porque nosotros tuvimos cuatro clases ya conmigo. Sí, correcto, y esas esa clases no me pude conectar. Ah, entonces sí es su primer clase. Correctamente. Es la primera vez que se... Ok. Eh, bueno. Um, ¿cuál, ¿Cuál es su número de teléfono? En el email está el enlace también de, de, WhatsApp. de WhatsApp. Igual acá en el chat ya envió yo la, la imagen. Porque la vamos a volver a usar. No, no le... Necesito que esté en WhatsApp. What's your phone number? Decirle acá. ¿Le doy mi número entonces? Sí, lo mandaron a intermedio 2, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Ah, bueno. Ok, ¿cuál es tu número de teléfono? 6028-5767. So, I will have you listen to your classmates. Right, well, I send you that in one second. I'm going to switch you. And you too, and you. Okay, so you can practice. Accept any invitation. You too, Madeline. 
Hello. Hola. Roberto, hi. No, we can't hear you. You sound you sound very far away. Do you have earphones? Yes. Hello. Maybe that's why. You hear me? Very uh -huh. far away. Put your your headset on. Maybe that's gonna help. Andrea, hi. Oh, all right. So let's let's start practicing. Enio and Andrea and Roberto, I hear you, but you sound super far away. So I don't know what to do. I think you need to get closer to your microphone or something. You can hear me. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. So uh, can you start, Andrea, please? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, can I borrow your phone to call my boss? I can't believe you still, but in the, in the future, I believe you have a, work, a good job. That's my hope. I <laughs> want to do that. <laughs> so it's, it's very difficult right now, but uh, I don't lose the hope. Yeah. Yeah. You don't lose yeah. hope. Yes, hope. Did you finish practicing the dialogue, guys? Yes. Yes. Um, um, uh, for first time, the uh, Gabriela, uh, she she is a uh, Jenny, and the second time, changed the person. And did you modify the dialogue? Uh, not really, uh, but uh, mm -hmm. well. <laughs> just when we were talking. <laughs> uh, oh, talking fine. because uh, she she's a new classmate. Oh really? Yes. This is your first yes. time, Gabriela. Are you on the WhatsApp group? Yes, yes, thank you. <laughs> no more absences, okay. right? <laughs> no, no, you know, it was a, a problem, not for me. It's just for the corporation. Oh, wow. um, yes, they called me and tell me that it was a problem. Um, but I'm here right now. So Okay, I'm happy for you then. Very good. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. It's a pleasure to me to work with you. All right. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> great, great, great. <laughs> I guess I let's go it. back then. Okay. Or, I don't know. I have to check everyone. Continue. Try to modify it. Two minutes. Okay. You finished? Yes. Almost. All right. Let's go back. Let me see. Okay. Break up. Okay, you guys finished. Did you modify the dialogue? Or you didn't? Yes, we did. You did? Uh, you wanna show us, Arturo? Okay. Go ahead. Javier changed the, 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 the word phone for iPad. For an iPad, okay, let's listen to it. We're gonna say lights, camera, action, go ahead. Okay, can I borrow your iPad to call my boss? Javier. <laughs> Javier. Hold on, wait, Javier. You still don't have a cell phone. Here you go. Okay. Yeah. Now, what do I need to do? It's all right. And don't forget to dial the area code. 
okay, I can see the number, but I can't hear anything. Oh, yeah. Because... No, literally, <laughs> we can't hear well, Javier. <laughs> that's actually true. It's really hard to hear you right now for some reason. But that's fine, okay? Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you guys for trying anyway. No pluses for them. Good job. Okay. Awesome. Now, um, we're going to change topics. Oh, there is a person who is not on WhatsApp here. So I'm sending to the chat on Zoom the link. All right. That's the link. It's in the email anyway. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, uh, uh. Here it is. So you already practiced those. Uh, imperatives let's see how you're gonna use them with other expressions all right read the instructions let me see who fair the instructions please with the objective fair. yeah sorry i was muted i was muted at the end of the lesson you will understand how to use imperatives and infinitives for giving suggestions uh -huh. thank you Get your notebooks out, everyone, and please write down the expressions we're gonna be using because we're gonna practice in a little bit, okay? So get the notebooks, take notes on the expressions. Here we go. To dial the area code. Hello, everyone. Before you watch the video, I want to remind you that imperatives are commands and they don't need a subject. Also, for giving suggestions, we will use an imperative as well as an infinitive. Stay around for more explanation. Imperatives and infinitives for giving suggestions. Be sure to turn it on. Don't forget to dial the area code. Make sure to hit the end button. Remember to pay the bill every month. Try not to talk for too long. This is how we'll use imperatives and infinitives for giving suggestions. When using an imperative, the subject is never mentioned and they always begin with a verb. And as said on the previous explanation, the infinitive is to plus a verb. Now let's think about a situation. These two kids are new to their English class and they say, we don't understand English. So let's give them a suggestion. We can say, study your verbs. But this sounds more like an instruction. So to make it a bit more polite and to actually sound like a suggestion, we may add, make sure to study your verbs. Check at the beginning we have no subject and then a verb, which means it's an imperative. Make sure. Moving forward to our infinitive to study. So when we put an imperative with an infinitive together, we can come up with a great suggestion. We will leave you now with some common expressions we use as imperatives to give suggestions. Be sure. Make sure. Don't forget. Remember. Try. Let's make examples using these expressions. Be sure to practice with your friends. Make sure to use a dictionary. Don't forget to think in English. Remember to do your English homework. Try to pronounce properly. Now read these suggestions. Be sure to speak in your native language. Make sure to forget your dictionary. Don't forget to stay quiet in class. Remember to translate into your native language. Try to mispronounce the words. You will agree with me that they are not good suggestions to give an English student. Therefore, we need to add the word not to make them positive suggestions. So the word not will go between the imperative and the infinitive. Now it is your turn. Ready to come up with examples of your own? Try it and write them on a Let's make examples and expressions we use. Okay, help me out here. Um, repeat, uh, repeat the expressions after me, okay? Be sure. Be sure. Be sure. But we're gonna say be sure to, because we're gonna use two after this. Be sure to, make sure to. Make sure make to. Sure to. Sure Don't to. forget to. Don't forget to. Forget to. Forget to. Remember to. Remember, Remember to, to try to, to try, to, try, to, try to. to. Okay, I'm going to give you a real scenario, a real example, and it is that I'm trying 
2, 2, wait, he says. Okay, so this is my situation. I'm trying to lose weight. What advice can you give me using these expressions? Anybody can participate. <laughs> it's real. <laughs> <laughs> So, true history. Sorry? To, to, eat, yeah, this is, to, to do exercise five times to the week. Five times a week. So be sure to do exercise five times a week. Okay, thank you. What else, guys? Remember to eat vegetable and fruit. I eat that, but it's not working. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is I eat more than that. <laughs> okay, what else? Try to understand the topic for today. Oh, but yeah, but hmm. <laughs> is that gonna help me <laughs> lose weight? I don't know. Yeah. It is. Make sure to wash your hands. Make sure to. to yes. Okay, let me see that. To watch. Watch your health. Yeah, that works. Okay, two more. Try to and don't, don't forget, forget to sleep. Don't, don't forget to sleep eight hours. To sleep try enough. Try to avoid pandus, okay? Try to avoid sweet <laughs> bread. Thank you. That's something I do every day, so yeah, I have to avoid it. Okay. And finally, don't forget to. Don't forget to sleep enough. Yeah, that's right. It's not well, sleep eight hours. To sleep eight hours, okay. Yeah. So that is how you give a great recommendation. Now I'm gonna just erase it all, all right? Uh, and now we need to make or come up with a negative form, okay? So negative form is going to be, be sure not to, okay? Not to. Make sure not, not to. Eat to junky food. Except don't forget, we cannot say don't forget not to because it's negative, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Remember, don't forget. Not to and try not to. Okay, now same situation. How can you say that? No, a different situation. I know to I have insomnia. Insomnia. I think that's how you spell it. So, what are some of your suggestions, guys? Be sure not to get your phone with you too late at, at night. Uh -huh. So be sure not to use your phone at night, right? At night. Very good. Everybody contribute, please. Make sure not to eat a lot of meal. Not to eat. Drink a lot of coffee. Not to eat a lot of what? Coffee. Make sure, make sure not, not to, to drink eat coffee. a lot. Drink, coffee. drink a lot of carbs. <laughs> a lot of what, Ligia? Carbos. Carbos. What is that? Carbohydrate. <laughs> I don't know how to say in English. Ah, not to eat. <laughs> not to eat. Maybe a lot of a lot of carbs or too many carbs. I had too many carbs. carbohydrates. Yeah. Okay. What else? Try not don't to forget to close your eyes and <laughs> don't think nothing. <laughs> don't forget to close your eyes. <laughs> Try not to play with my heart. <laughs> not to what? <laughs> play with my heart. <laughs> okay, well, how does, ah, no, I understand, but other people will play with your heart, so you cannot sleep then, right? <laughs> so maybe try not to get your heart broken. No, <laughs> don't get your heart broken so you won't have insomnia. <laughs> well, that's a good advice, that's a good piece of advice. Okay, is it clear? Is the structure clear? Yes, that's clear. I want you to use all the expressions, affirmative and negative form. So I'm going to send you some situations here. Hold on. Check what's up, guys. What's up, guys? Um, one second. <clears throat> Thank you. 
Okay. You can still see my screen, right? Let me see. <clears throat> We're gonna nice. use this picture. You can choose any number, and this is gonna be your problem. All right. Oh my gosh. Don't look. <laughs> All right, that's gonna be your problem. Any of these numbers. So, um, mm. imagine, choose one, and you're gonna say, for example, "Hey, I'm broke." Okay, meaning I have no money at all, and you have okay. to start giving the other person advice. Say, "Hey, make sure to try not to." Okay, mm. everybody gives the person advice. And then another person has a problem, everyone else gives advice, and so on. Is that clear? That's clear. Choose a problem and then give advice. We're going to work in groups of three or four. So, accept the invitation, please. Here we go. Let's practice. And for example, don't forget to uh, don't forget uh, don't forget to find in uh, to in look. the car. Don't forget to look in the car. To look in, this is already the verb for me. <laughs> to look in, yes. Don't forget to look in the car, very good. I don't know who else. No? <laughs> Olga? Yes. I don't know why, but you are not in yet, but I can hear you. Me? You hear me? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mariela, yes. Yes. Okay. Well, so so. Mm, I can hear you very well. Yes, it's like a deep voice. Yes. So, <laughs> and now? Gabriela, can you get very close to your microphone like this? Or, or put it under your mouth, like this. <laughs> I hear. I can hear Gabriela. Yeah. So I hear. Uh, I can hear very well, Olga. Yeah, me either. I can hear Olga. Hey, Olga. Okay. And now? Yes. Now. Yeah. <laughs> very so good. So, what is the situation? I would need advice. Let's practice quickly. Uh, basically, my problem is that I have a headache. <laughs> okay, advice girls. Try, try not to see. Okay. <laughs> for your advice, now is the time to turn off Sonia. Sonia, your problem. What is your problem? Um, my English isn't very good. <laughs> um, try don't to for... start it. Ah, no, no. Okay. Yes, uh, your parents? Okay, I try to. My advice is uh, try to to 
to get some talk with 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 them and and try to be honest with your with your feelings okay and then they what is the what 41. is the 41 50 50 uh, and 52 40. someone stole my wallet someone stole my wallet oh okay and don't forget <laughs> really probably <laughs> yes don't forget to I don't know how to you say the denunciar teach. <laughs> don't forget to it's a, it's a problem when it's stolen to your wallet. Ah, to call the police, right? To call the police. Uh -huh. Or uh, don't forget to to go and buy and buy one. Another another one. Or or file a report. Okay. Bye. File, file a report. File a report, yes. Ah, okay. File a report. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Um, if for the stolen, ask the people that will be uh, stolen your wallet if give you the documents <laughs> because <laughs> it's a problem. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, okay. Um, uh, oh, another problem. Okay, 38, uh, I'm always late. 48. Okay. 48. Andrea. No, no, 38. Mm -hmm. 38, I'm always late. Uh, I'm always late, yes. Uh, uh, to drink water. <laughs> 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 Make sure to find a map. Hello, teacher. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I okay. can see something. Are you shaking or practice? <laughs> yes, I am. Great. Oh, yeah, okay, I can um, see you. It's okay. My team, turns. I can't swim. You can't? What number is? You can't uh, swing team? or swim. I can swim. Ah, uh, swim. Yeah, yeah cause swing team. is like 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 monkeys, right? Oh, oh, ah, ah, no, like, <laughs> uh, like swim. Uh, uh, swim. Okay, what's your advice, guys? Try to take uh, swim classes. Swimming lessons. <laughs> Keep your money with you. Yes. <laughs> okay. Roberto? Okay. Yes. Don't forget to try some food in Egypt. Yes. Okay. Different food. Anna, different food. Anna, your turn. One number to one to five. To one to five. The four? Number four. Okay. One, two, three, four. It's my mother's birthday. birthday. Tomorrow. It's my mother's birthday. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, my advice in this case. Um, will be remember uh, remember I I don't know who to say remember have remember to uh, emerging remember to all of those remember to have to remember to don't forget to try to use the, remember to have remember to have a emer emergency An how do you say number Emergency number. An emergency cool. number. Yep, this is my advice. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay. Okay. I think we're gonna go back now. Let me see. No, 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 continue. Two more minutes. Okay. <laughs> go ahead. Okay. Uh, it's it's my, my turn, right? Yeah. Yep. Yes. Uh, number five. I can't sleep at night. I think, I don't know. 
<laughs> I don't know, Olga, if you have a, another suggestion for the the problem of Bobby? Um, I, I think, um, do you want to tell us a problem? Oh, yeah. yes. So the problem is it the number Tiri? Hey. Yes. Mm -hmm. I hate my job. I hate my job. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say the same. I'm going to say the same the same thing, yeah. <laughs> Just change it. Just change it. Be sure to change it the next year, the next week, or I know. <laughs> or tomorrow. <laughs> or tomorrow, yeah. I'm uh, out. <laughs> uh, my opinion is uh, the relaxing. I'll try to use one of the expressions, say, make sure to, be sure oh. to. Ah, it's like be sure to relax. Uh -huh, yes, use the expression. Relax, relax. Uh -huh. Be sure to relax. Not to relax. Um, the verb in infinitive to relax. Okay, relax, relax. In, in the job. Uh -huh. um, so, for instance, David, you could have said um, be sure to change your job. Right? Mm -hmm. Be sure to change them. You don't like your boyfriend? Change them. You don't like your work? Change it. <laughs> Just change everything. It's not that easy, it, David. It's not so easy. easy. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. make it seem easy, but it's not. <laughs> I like the clothes. I'm going to change it. <laughs> yeah, I don't like this. Let me change it right now. It doesn't work like that. <laughs> okay. Let's go back, um, guys. <laughs> Some pieces of advice were very funny. Yeah. <laughs> In our group, we, we have very, very funny suggestions. Oh, I want to hear some. Tell me. Ask Vanessa. <laughs> no, I'm asking you for a coin. <laughs> Ask Vanessa. Tell me, what was it? No, because I, I changed some, some situations sometimes. Mm -hmm. For example, I, I'm going through it. Uh, I want to marry a sugar mom. Okay, wow. <laughs> ah, I see. And what was their their advice? Vanessa. Vanessa, what did you say? Uh, make sure to be kind with her. Uh -huh, okay. <laughs> Good. No, I like David's advice. They were saying, I don't like my, I don't like my, my job. Well, make sure to change it, right? And I say, what if you don't like your boyfriend or something? Make sure to change it. <laughs> and everything just changes. So pretty easy. Easy advice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you don't like something, change like, it. Don't complicate your life. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Okay. So we were practicing six expressions, I think. What are they? We have remember to what else? I hope you practice because some of you were not doing it. So I don't know. I don't know what's up. Right. Remember to, what else? Make sure. Make sure to. Mm -hmm. Try to. to. Forget to. Get to. Get to. Make sure to. Make sure not. For two. That's it, right? Is that it? One, two, three, four, five, just five expressions. Yeah. Really? Okay. I thought we had more. Try, don't forget, remember. Anyway, uh, let's do this exercise and with this we'll finish. Ana Molina, number one. I'm trying to keep, keep it close to protect the, the screen. 
the option is uh, the laptop computer. Very good, thank you. Ligia. Don't forget to write down your secret code. And the answer is... Ooh, right um, now, it's, don't, don't pronounce this W. Uh, cell phone? Mm -hmm. Maybe. I think it's not the phone, right guys? I think it's another answer. So guys, uh, I think I have told you when you say right, wrong. Or you are your... Don't pronounce this W. No, it's something else. Mm -mm. Laptop. I think it's a laptop. Mm-hmm. So guys, whenever you have W-R, don't pronounce those W's, okay? So you're only gonna say right, wrong, and right again. So, laptop, maybe. Laptop, okay. Three, Carlos Calderon. Carlos. The sorry, sorry, okay, thank you. Number three, remember to need off as soon as you come in the door. Sorry, need off as soon as you come in the door. Alarm system. Very good. Okay, next, Daniel Melendez. Try not, try not to get, to get it when are the keys. I'll try not to get May. it wet. Or the keys may get stuck. What do you think it is? I don't know. Maybe the laptop the computer. Mm hmm I think it is. Okay, Sonia? So, yeah. To set it each time you leave home. Um, alarm system? Yes. So, guys, when you go to bed, you set the alarm, right? That is the word, set the alarm. Okay, number six, uh, Carlos Ortiz, you're on mute. It's me. Mm -hmm. Sure. Uh, number six um, will be cell phone. But read this. To church. Remember to cell phone. The batteries. Read the statement first and then the answer before they die. So, guys, when the battery is at zero percent, you call it die, right? You say, My phone died. My battery yep. died. Okay, so uh, cell. Yes, Patricia Flamenco. First the statement, then the answer. Be sure to turn it off before bed or a call may wake you up. Up. A cell phone? Let's see. Hmm, there's a mistake. Write down your secret code. I think this is the alarm system number two. It's alarm system. Yes, right. Alarm. Okay. Now everything is good. Okay. Thank you very much, guys. We have finished. So this is where we left. And where we left off. 2.9. Okay. Tomorrow we're going to continue in section three, I hope. Any questions? No questions. Oh, let's take the picture. All right, smile, everyone. I'm gonna take a picture. Hey, Gerardo, I hadn't seen you. <laughs> All right, everybody, there it is. And <laughs> hold on, I need one more. <laughs> one second. Hold on. Yeah. No, wait, wait. <laughs> need one more, wait. Okay. One, two, three. Three. 
Thank you. All right. I hope to see you all tomorrow. Have a beautiful okay. night. Tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye.